Ready, go. Good protection. And down the middle of the field, and here's Jordy Nelson. He's inside the 20. And run out of bounds inside the 10. Nelson trying to shake off the rust from that injury a season ago. He started this year very well, has been very quiet until now. He starts on the left side, but he runs a deep crossing route to the opposite flag. And this is a defense that has given up a lot of big plays in the passing game in their zone scheme. You see Keanu Neal, who he he doesn't anticipate that Jordy Nelson's going to keep going. He gets by him the hole in the zone. Rodgers takes a hit late, but that ball was thrown right on the money in stride. Well, they have Devontae Adams in the backfield right now. Rodgers looked at him initially and throws into the end zone, and that is a touchdown for Jordy Nelson. So for an offense without Randall Cobb, without Ty Montgomery, without Eddie Lacy, without James Starks, without Jared Cook, that's a pretty impressive beginning. Yes, it is. And you're going to see Jordy Nelson. He just finds the hole in the zone, and no linebacker picks him up. And Aaron Rodgers, he didn't have to escape the pocket. You leave the pocket to buy yourself some time. Right out! <laughs> Great protection. Looking down the field in the end zone, and it is a touchdown! Taylor Gabriel. 47 yards. How about that? Shanahan talked about it and said Tyler Gabriel is one of the guys young player that can blow the top off the defense and you see the job that he does getting down the field Dimitri Goodson but Matt Ryan has to put this ball perfectly and allow Gabriel to go get it the coverage really was not that bad you see the throw here from Matt Ryan and he has to split the two defenders and why they've had some of the holes that, that they've had Inside the 30 and another big play for an offense that those have been few and far between this year Boy Adams really playing well. Well, he starts in the backfield. So now they've got Devontae Adams playing the position that we've seen from Ty Montgomery a missed tackle there and it allows Adams then as you see Keanu Neal and a 90 yard interception return in front of friends and family third and goal and Rodgers throws to the end zone and that is a touchdown Geronimo Geronimo Allison just brought up after a great preseason they had to turn him loose they activate him this week off the practice squad and Geronimo indeed <laughs> well Credit Aaron Rodgers for keeping the play alive. He's able to move up in the pocket and then slide. And Geronimo uncovers himself. You, know, you talked about it coming out of camp. Ready, go. Rodgers asking Davis to come back and get it, and that is a touchdown. What a throw by Rodgers on the run. He's already had his first catch. Davis started this drive with a big punt return, and he ends it with his first career touchdown. Well, this is what we got used to seeing from Aaron Rodgers. That ball is perfectly placed on the pylon, and he let pylon, and he lets his guy go get it. But you get an upfield rusher from the defensive end, and Rodgers slides up and then out. We've seen that over and over. Actually, coming into the game, but he's been hobbled a little bit clearly. How about the day being put to? Rushing play for the Falcons. Raymond looking for daylight and finds the end zone. That's a beautifully designed play by Shanahan and company. Getting into the hands of the playmaker Freeman. And that's his second receiving touchdown of the year. Well, they split Devontae Freeman out. You're going to see Lyman get out in front, but Initially, it looked like the Packers had Freeman bottled up, but he's able to knife his way in there. And that's, an, that's an excellent job finishing off this drive. The Packers have been able to force some field goals down here. This time, the Falcons are able to. Rodgers going to run it. He's got a lot of room. And he 
brings up to the 50-yard line, and there's 18 seconds left. That's better than a long. Ready, go. Cross the middle, and it's juggled, and then hanging on is Nelson. They'll call a timeout. Down to the 30-yard line, eight seconds remain. How about that catch. Stick a fork in it. They rush three, and so Rodgers has some time. I couldn't tell if there was a hand on it by Trufant or not. I don't think so. I think it just kind of got up on Jordy Nelson, but he sticks.